Hey y'all, this is Beth with Midlands Vinyl. So one of the questions I get asked frequently is, do I make or buy my own pinstripes? The answer to that is, I make them. And I'm going to show you how to do it without having the gap in between your lines. Now this again is for silhouette. I don't know anything about um, this is for Cameo. I don't know anything about a Cricut, but I can help you with a silhouette. So you're going to come over here to your drawing tools. You're going to select rectangle. You're just going to draw your rectangle. It doesn't matter about the size at this point. Okay. You can determine how long you need it and how wide you need it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to come over here to the transform panel and make sure this is unlocked. Now my typical... The typical pinstripe size that I use is 0, 0.00. You can make this 12. You can make this 10. You can. You, you are in control of the numbers. I'm going to click apply. You see how it shrunk that down? So then I'm going to come over to the replicate panel. And I'm going to go to rows and columns. I'm going to click the very last one. It says column of four. Now you can fill the page, but you see you're going to have those gaps, which is okay if you want to use the inside of those gaps for another pinstripe. I don't want to do that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to set it to go to column of four. So I'm going to go all the way down. So I'm just going to click, 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 click until I fill up the whole entire sheet and then you literally send and that's it now you have pinstripes with no gaps so i hope that was helpful if it was please give us a thumbs up and make sure that you are subscribed so you don't miss out on any new tutorials we have coming up i will see you guys later bye